Soul Recipes member Valerie Lin says that this recipe for luscious slush punch is, without a doubt, the best punch I've ever had. Since it makes enough for two punch bowls, it's perfect for entertaining. Valerie notes that this punch is a Christmas Eve tradition for her family and says, there is never a drop left. Feeling punchy? Let's get started. Measure six cups of water into a large saucepan or stock pot. Then add two three ounce size packages of strawberry flavored gelatin mix. And two and a half cups of sugar. If you prefer a less sweet punch, go ahead and reduce the sugar by as much as half. It's all a matter of preference. Stir this mixture together. Then bring it to a boil over medium heat. Let it boil for three minutes. Then stir in one 46 ounce can of pineapple juice. Two thirds of a cup of lemon juice and one quart of orange juice. Now let the juices cool. Next, you need to freeze the juice. We'll wanna make three separate batches, so we'll pour the punch into three separate containers. We're using a glass pitcher to support a one gallon zipper style freezer bag. These bags are perfect for this, especially if you need to transport the punch to a party. Place the filled bags in a nine by 13 tray and put that into the freezer for about eight hours or overnight. A little before you're ready to serve the punch, combine the contents of one of the containers with a two liter bottle of lemon lime soda. Go ahead and do this right in the punch bowl. Stir the punch until it becomes slushy. Once the first batch of punch has been polished off by thirsty guests, take the second container out of the freezer and mix it with another two liter bottle of lemon lime soda. Let the party continue.